Hi, Brent Tech here, where Tech is made simple. Windows 10 KB4577586 is an update rolling out worldwide that will finally remove Adobe Flash from your Windows 10 PC. I've spoken about this before and I see that this morning the update installed and removed Adobe Flash from my PC. So if you haven't received it already, I'm sure that in the next day or two you will receive the update. Now Microsoft says that this is an optional update, but I see that on my machine it was downloaded and installed automatically and I've also heard other reports about that. So if you go to your search box and you type in settings and you navigate to update and security, because it is an optional update, you should see a header here saying optional update, which you click on and then you can download and install the update manually. If you'd like to see if you have it on your machine, go to view update history and scroll down to the bottom of the page and click on other updates. And here we can see update for removal of Adobe Flash Player for Windows 10 version 20H2 KB4577586. So that has finally removed Adobe Flash Player from my system. Now, apparently, this update cannot be uninstalled. So it's not like a security patch or a cumulative update that you get monthly where you can go into uninstall updates and uninstall it from your system. This update cannot be uninstalled and you cannot restore Flash Player. So this process is final. Now, apparently this update does not remove Flash Player installed by third-party apps. It only removes Flash Player installed by Microsoft. So if you have installed Flash with a third-party app, then you should go and down, uh, uninstall that from your machine manually because Flash Player um, um, imposes a security risk if it is installed on your machine. Now, as I say, it is only, uh, only uh, it only uninstalls Flash Player installed by Microsoft. So if you navigate back to your search box and you type in Control, this takes us to the legacy control panel in Windows 10. And you will see that there used to be an icon residing somewhere about here saying Flash Player. Now this update has finally removed that icon, so that is very good to know. If you still have that icon, saying Flash Player, you have not received the update. Now, this follows basically what Edge, and Microsoft Edge and Google Chrome have done. They've also discontinued um, uh, support for Flash. So this update looks like this is the final nail in the coffin for Adobe Flash Player on Windows 10. I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.